Hi, and welcome to the Unknown Secrets of Website Analysis with eWebStyle. Uh, my name is Chris Burris. We're looking at Goodman Plumbing. Uh, it's actually listed as Goodman Plumbing Services here. The website is actually goodmanplumbing.com. Uh, actually, I spoke with Patrick this week. He's on vacation uh, for the rest of the week. Uh, he's been a longtime listener of our Unknown Secrets of SEO podcast and will now soon be a customer of eWebStyle. Um, Patrick has a lot of plans and uh, one of his focuses is this particular website and so we're gonna let's 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 do an analysis um, the first impression of, of me and actually everybody here at the office was this is it's got a nice feel I, I don't I would say look and feel because that kind of implies navigation uh, but it's got a nice feel you know it's plumbing it's clean the images are crisp um, he actually has a reasonable call to action um, and normally I think we tend to look for calls to action in the upper right um, there's probably some unique statistics about that uh, but you know right here it's call for free phone consultation there on the lower lower right and it actually has his phone number um, like I said the images are real quick crisp he does have you know so the other thing that we look for quickly on a website is a unique selling proposition and a unique selling proposition is typically like I've been in business for 30 years or we're BB, BBB certified or whatever we are, you know, we're certified plumbers, maybe a plumber's license, um, if that's relevant in that particular state. Um, he does have why choose GPS. By the way, GPS, um, we think you should change that because uh, GPS is so much associated with navigation that people are going to see that. In fact, uh, Chuck even said when he came here, uh, he was like thinking he was on the wrong website. Uh, so, you know, it, GPS is just too much related to uh, navigation. I really would uh, probably change that logo out. You could keep the GPS in it, but tone it down and, you know, maybe at least get a faucet, yeah, you know, yeah, symbol coming off of uh, one of the letters or something um, so that that works. We know that he's actually doing um, some remodeling and he's got another website, the Goodman Plumbing Services.com website is going to be coming out that will actually be doing specific plumbing services. So we'll look at this strictly from the perspective of, uh, of doing remodeling. If you scroll down, um, and actually if we look at the navigation, sorry Chuck, if you look at the navigation here, it's really kind of hidden. This is, this is well laid out, although it is also small. Um, I think it's a nice idea with the little icons. I would want to bring the icons closer because uh, it almost looks like there's a click here, 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 mm -hmm. and here, instead of them being you know individualized. Also, you know, some of these symbols are just, they're, they're not relevant. Uh, you've got a little suitcase for why choose GPS. Um, click why choose GPS. I haven't, I haven't gone on there and see it, to see what, what they have. Um, ethics, that's actually good. Ethics, quality workmanship. He's got a, um, what is this called? A cloud, cloud. a tag mm -hmm. cloud. Um, they honor warranties. That's an them. image cloud though, isn't it? Yeah, it's not an actual tag cloud. Um, it's a cool concept. Um, uh, and and uh, it's fine on an interior page. Certainly wouldn't want to waste space on the front page with that. Um, yeah, so and then they talk about the GPS system. Again, the GPS system, which we know means Goodman Plumbing Services system, uh, but GPS system sounds like navigation, so I'm, I'm probably not going to read it. He does have a video. We didn't watch the video, uh, and we won't do that here. He also, this is one comment I didn't make to, to Patrick the other day. Uh, he's got his tweets on here. And he's talking about um, some politically uh, challenging stuff, you know, like Ireland is foreshadowing to, you know, what's going on, what's going to happen here in the U.S., I imagine is the implication. Uh, we tend to suggest that you keep your political um, affiliations separate from your business um, unless, that's, unless that's one of your unique selling points. Uh, and I wouldn't say that that's what he's going for here. Uh, and then he's got um, a, a Facebook link that's great. Uh, he's not as active in Facebook as he should be, so um, we'll go from there. And it's a WordPress site, so uh, that's that's pretty cool. We like WordPress sites. Let's look at some of his stats. I think we've got that. No, nope, I think you have to right click and then then go to Quake Info Page Info. Oops. Also. Swing and a miss. All right, so um, he actually has title tags. That's a good sign. 
Um, again, it's the Y choose GPS. Um, oh, that's a, that's not the home page, but that this is going to be ex you know exemplary of what he's doing everywhere. Um, and it's Goodman Plumbing, Goodman Plumbing. Uh, again, people aren't probably going to be searching for Goodman Plumbing, and if they are, you don't really need to advertise that in your title because they're going to find you anyway. Um, meta tags. Uh, these look a little better. I would say that the last tag is actually best. So well, second best. You've got plumbers, Raleigh, North Carolina, and you've got plumbing ex experts, North Carolina. I don't think North Carolina plumbing experts, North Carolina is probably right because I doubt you serve the whole North Carolina area, um, uh, the whole state. So you really might want to narrow that down. Uh, and then the meta description again is what shows up in the search engine results pages. Uh, they only work with reputable companies. That's a good tag. Reputable builders and contractors. Although I know he's kind of changing that focus. He's got zero backlinks according to Google. He's got 18 according to Yahoo. Uh, that's a little low. Certainly we want to get those up. Um, the domain age is, it must be new, it must be very new. Um, let's see, keyword densities there. And he does have a site map and a robot text file. So those are good things. So he's doing a lot of really good basics. Um, one of the reasons we like WordPress is it kind of uh, really makes those things easy. Um, let's look at his most repeats is the GPS system. So frankly, if somebody are, were in North Carolina looking for some sort of GPS system, they might end up on your website. Uh, and we would definitely say that's a bad experience for the Google user. So that's not really what you're, uh, what you're after. Um, days ago, reply, retweet. That's interesting. That's pulling out of the retweet, mm -hmm. I guess. That's interesting. Um, and then code of ethics. So there's none of these keywords are actually plumbing related. Yeah, no uh, water heater, tankless water heater. We saw on our homepage. You know, none of that. Nothing. So um, really, the content has not been optimized for search engine optimization uh, for the for the search robots or the Google monster, uh, as it were. Um, all right. Any any other comments from you guys? Um, I would talk about the navigation here. Uh, I'll, it's kind side. of kind of this really turns out to be duplicate navigation um, it probably actually has some value for SEO because I'm guessing it's text um, is it, does that look like text? yeah so it's text so this is at least I'm sure I'm guessing these are images no that's text also um, yeah I think you, you're sacrificing you got the space across here I think you clean that up and you get rid of this navigation or vice versa I mean either way and make this one a little bit bigger uh, and a little bit more Use prominent this one for the services. Yeah, yeah. You, you put know. a list of your services there. Um, Go to his homepage. Scroll down. Does it say anything about North Carolina? Um, uh, image map. It does. P1 okay, license North Raleigh Carolina. for twelve years. Uh, I would. Uh, there's nothing here that. Well, I think that the information that's right here needs to be above the fold. And, and shorter, right, yeah, and, and uh, bullet points. He says, type. we've been in Raleigh for 12 years. We are experienced in all residential plumbing, remodeling, renovation work. Let me see that as soon as I get. Yeah, over here. As maybe soon as you up get. here. Because yeah. all I see is, is this right here. And I also think that he could have a stronger call to action, call for a free phone consultation. That's something that people are accustomed to hearing. Yeah. Call now for... Free estimate, call now for free this. I would go with something a little more unique and catchy because my first thought is if you sell uh, sinks and faucets, what exactly does the phone, does consultation. phone consultation? Well, you know, and that's a good, I'm glad you brought that up because Charles, his first impression is that he actually sell either he sells just the, the actual the hardware, fixtures, the mm -hmm. fixtures. Um, oh, and doesn't necessarily does. do remodeling. Yeah. If you scroll yeah. down, he does the actual remodeling. Oh, okay. Right? Plumbing. Well, his, his, his flash is doesn't showing, say that. Yeah, he's just showing images. His, his flash image, it shows that he sells those things. I think he has too many images. Yeah. And I think they scroll too fast. They I think should it's be distracting. Maybe uh, before and after pics. Yeah. Yes. You know, that that would show that remodeling. Says that remodeling. would show remodeling. Yeah. This so, says I sell fixes. nice faucets. <laughs> yes. Really nice ones. And might install them, which he yes. happens yeah. to do. Yeah. So you're thinking this should just be about the different services that he does. Yeah. Uh, remodeling, 
uh, renovation here, remodeling, take kitchen, this water heaters, yeah. you know, the whole, I would do one for each one of his services. Click a services page, or he just has one page dedicated to all services. Okay. And see, the, it, it, again, his business focus is changing a little. He was focusing on construction. Things have been slow. Uh, so now he's going to be focusing on. But this is this page is the <laughs> first time that I got the impression that, clear that he, he does, does any of these work. things. Yeah. Phone number at the thing. bottom. It should, you know, prominent across the top. Yeah. Probably with some sort of call to action and a, and a USP. Anything else? Um, well, I think that's... All right, you guys have been listening to the Unknown Secrets of Website Analysis with eWebStyle. Uh, again, if you would like your website analyzed, just go to eWebStyle.com, and on the right, you'll see a short form. Fill that out. Uh, we're going to add a little checkbox to make sure that uh, you actually want to be shown on air. Uh, for now, we're just taking a little bit of liberty. Uh, <laughs> my name is Chris Burris. Thanks for checking in with us.